In order to make the most out of your Socito account, it's important to set up effective search criteria when looking for leads. To help you get an idea of the kinds of criteria that will generate the best results for you, we're going to walk through a specific example of setting up the criteria tool. Let's say that I work for a software company whose product helps developers with UX design and customer experience. I've already started prospecting for potential customers by adding keywords to my criteria section. I have been focused on finding CIOs, CTOs, UX designers, and developers living near San Francisco and, based on conversational keywords, are talking about user experience, product management, and product engagement. This set of criteria has generated some pretty good results, but I'm seeing some irrelevant prospects. For example, there are a couple of corporate Twitter profiles that I'd rather not have in my results. I can see the bios of the companies showing up here often include words like jobs and design while individuals don't include those keywords in their bio. So going back to my criteria, I'm going to add negative keywords for the words jobs and design. I do this by typing in a minus sign followed by the term I don't want my prospects to have in their bio. Next, I'm going to toggle the switch above the bio section on my criteria pane from may to must. This will ensure Socito shows me only prospects with one of my chosen keywords in their bio. Now I'll hit the Save and Refresh Leads button at the bottom of the pane. As you can see, my results are now much more specific to the leads that I'm interested in, so I won't have to spend as much time sifting through irrelevant profiles. For more information on how to optimize your Socito activity, please visit blog.socito.com.